Guess hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Oscar Outdoors. Join me in this one as I show you how to correctly use Molly and power systems. So welcome back everyone, uh, as a little intro I'm going to teach you today how to correctly install um, pouches and things onto Molly. So Molly first of all stands for Modular Light Load Bearing Equipment and PALS uh, which you may know referred to is the Pouch Attachment Ladder System. So basically this that runs down the back of the pouch. Now if you're a regular subscriber to the channel you'll know that I use uh, a lot of tactical looking equipment and uh, a lot of molly and a lot of pals you know my cook sets in a uh, molly pouch uh, you know my snug pack endurance is uh, a, a molly backpack uh, I've got some Wii Sport uh, pockets on the side of that endurance etc etc uh, now I use that because it is just so versatile and you can set things up how you like it um, now I've done uh, modifications on my snug pack endurance which I'll leave up here for you now um, which has obviously helped me uh, to get my my sort of perfect system. Uh, now, when I first started using Molly, um, I was using it incorrectly. Like many people, all I was doing is taking the ladder system off the back of the pouch and then just threading it quite simply down the Molly attachments of the bag, like so. And then, obviously, just clipping at the bottom. And then they were on, but obviously they were loose and unrigid, and you know, basically it didn't look good, did it? It just looks a little bit poor, a little bit dire. Uh, so today's video is all about teaching you how to do uh, Molly systems correctly. So what I've brought is I've just got a little bit of 25 mil webbing, which is similar to what you'll find on the back of pouches. Okay, not too dissimilar, is it? Yeah, I'm just going to show you on camera how to thread it and obviously then I'm going to attach a pouch. So I've readjusted uh, the system now. Now what I was doing originally is I was taking up the Molly and PAL systems and I was just doing this. Threading the PALs down the back of all the Molly and then it was threaded but then obviously still a little bit loose. And the pouches were a little bit wobbly and things like that. So what I've done is I've researched how to install properly. Uh, and now I'm going to teach that to you. Uh, so essentially, every time you have a gap on the line of molly, this is where you will re-thread on the back of your pouch. So if you look on the back of the pouch, just here, you've got more ladder systems coming down. So essentially, what these will do is they'll marry up similar to this there so you've got the molly on the thing you're attaching to in this case the, uh, the vest and um, but obviously a backpack or whatever then you've got one on here so what you do then is you'd feed down the back of your pouch like so and then you'd go back to your attaching product that makes sense so obviously backpack pouch backpack pouch and then just keep threading it and threading it and threading it right so I'm going to do that now for you this works best if your pouches are empty to begin with uh, and then obviously just line up what you can see um, where you're going to be so you basically want the pals or the uh, pouch attachment ladder system to be starting on one of these lines and then Okay, then you're going to be threading through here, threading through there, and obviously vice versa. So, we'll do that now. We'll stick that straight down there. Now, I've not measured if this is going to be the perfect place. As I say, do this while it's empty. Okay, and then you can see 
or you might not be able to see when I turn sideways when I fold that over that line will be on the buckles there and then the pouch system will be in the gap can you see that okay so now what you'll do is then thread your pouch so I'll do this side correctly and I'll do this side incorrectly so I'll just do this on the system all the way down now it can be a bit fiddly and there are such things as molly threading systems uh, which you can pick up on Amazon and things like that uh, but yeah for now uh, I'm just doing all this by hand so I've gone through the backpack say, pouch now back to the backpack back here now as I say it's a bit fiddly by hand but you know well worth it to get it done properly in the end okay then back through the back the pouch back through the backpack okay back through the pouch again you can see it's getting more and more difficult as I get towards the bottom and thankfully I've measured this just right back through uh, the backpack on the rigid one and then last but not least a little presto snap okay and I'm just going to do the presto on the other side right so that's how to install correctly down this side uh, so when I turn it to the side you'll see that it's threaded correctly when I show you this side you'll see that it's not As I said, this is the uh, the vest plate, and you can see the top one. The PAL system goes over the top of the molly on the vest, and then the PALS is on every in between. So PALS, so pouch, 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 and then obviously plate, plate, plate on these here. Now I've gone over uh, down the back of the molly, down the back of the pouch, down the back of the molly, down the back of the pouch, down the back of the uh, molly down the back of the pouch and then snapped in at the bottom you can see that is very very rigid and not going to go anywhere now the other side is installed incorrectly I'll just turn that around for you now this is how I used to install molly until I uh, discovered this way now look at that you can see it's a hell of a lot looser I've not utilized any of the pals on the back of the pouch just gone down the back of the molly and it is secure enough don't get me wrong but it's not going to be held in place for you for too long uh, if this pops off for instance you know after a little bit of jiggling that is going to come out and you're going to lose a pouch or whatever but yeah you can see this side so much rigidity and then this side is absolutely solid so yeah right i'll install this correctly and show you the difference Okay, so now you can see that I've installed, well you can't see, I've installed it correctly. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to shut this pouch up. and just show you on this side now. Again, you can see the ladder system on the, on the back of the pouch. And then the molly on the thing, alternating between the gaps. And it's just threaded basically in, out, in, out, in, out. Sort of like this. And it, look at that for rigid, I mean besides the pouch, let's take that off. That is absolutely solid. You know, you're not going to lose that, even if it does come undone uh, while you're in transit somewhere. You know, it's held in place to maximum effect there, and the, the press studs are just there for that last little line of defence, I suppose. But yeah, that's how the end of the molly looks, and it's absolutely perfect now since i've done this it's been an absolute game changer for me I, you know, i've stopped losing pouches i've stopped uh, losing little bits of gear and things like that and it's been an absolute life changer uh, so yeah if you've enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to comment let me know what you thought have you done molly and pals incorrectly in the past and has this video helped you uh, if you're not already please subscribe to the channel i'll see you in the next one